the images are real. His story is horrific. Hi, my name is Sean Carter. But Sean Carter has lived to share his experience. RTBI. And he visited Wasako ISD to educate our students about the dangers of drunk driving. Can you even imagine what life would be like if you couldn't talk? Hoping to prevent other people from having to live the life that Sean has had. Drinking was just the presentation comes as did. spring break is Mom approaching. Told us, don't drink and, and right ride. around the corner don't is prom. Ride with someone who has been drinking. Along with the dances, football and basketball games, and various extracurricular activities, students will be faced with some difficult choices. Choices to go out and drink, or even use drugs. With every choice there's a consequence. Sean's dream was to become an attorney. He grew up thriving as a student athlete and was academically strong. At 22 years old, college graduation was not too far away. He did some modeling on the side to make a few bucks. He happened to go out the Saturday night before Easter Sunday with a couple of friends drinking, and he was not the driver, he was a passenger. Sean was involved in a terrifying car accident with most of the damage on his side. He suffered a massive traumatic brain injury. He was totally incapacitated, couldn't move anything on his right side at all, and um, he couldn't even hold his head up. And everybody told us, Sean's not gonna be able to work. You know, he's not gonna really have a future. Sean was in a coma for 39 days. After he overcame he that, Sean Not required around-the-clock care. The Both came to the realization the of how life has changed moving forward. Through his fight side. also came the idea of that raising awareness. Saying. They all seem to be listening. Hopefully we change their opinion about drinking in order to have fun. Sitting in the bleachers, students sit stunned. A few even get emotional. It made me really sad. I was crying at one point. Um, it just hurts to see people like that. I don't think anyone deserves to go through that. Even some people around, like when they saw the pictures of like him like with the bruised belly or like him with the bolts, he, I was hearing kids like, I could hear the uh, like them shock. Sean is happy to be alive and is dealing with his situation as best as possible. Others are not so lucky and the Carter family wants all the boys and girls to keep that in mind. They need to remember they've got the rest of their life ahead of them. If you choose to accept my challenge, you will see the drinking underage and irresponsibly is nothing. I'm Mike Gonzalez. But a waste of money and even time.